course, the, the World Cup is a very important milestone in Qatar's history and uh, Qatar's development plans for the future. When we first bid for the World Cup, we always had the vision that this World Cup will be a catalyst for positive change. It is an important opportunity to showcase the region in a positive light and bring the world together to celebrate on this greatest platform, uh, greatest sporting platform. There have been uh, more than one million uh, migrant workers in Qatar. In the situation of Qatar, trade unions are not allowed. You know, labor laws are not updated to the international labor standards. So that's why BW came here and talked to the workers, talked to the government official, and tell them how we can respond. How can we improve the situation of migrant workers? The World Cup has an opportunity to change the situation because there's a public attention. It is important that, you know, the World Cup is popular in all parts of the world. And we can use sports as an opportunity to improve. In Qatar, what we did is to have a high-level mission and we found a lot of problems. But our approach is we talk to the Supreme Committee. For the past three years, we have been talking with the Supreme Committee, trying to dialogue, try to convince them that it's good that they should respect human rights. They should address the issue of migrant workers. We have learned the training uh, that we've received from BWI, the joint inspections have identified areas that we need to improve and we can improve. It's important to acknowledge that Qatar is now taking more and more steps on the issue of labor law because of and thanks to the support of BWI. Yesterday, we experienced ourselves during a survey that a test report was lacking on the scaffold. Every week, a new label has to be attached to it to prove that the scaffold has been checked. That was missing. The workers were immediately taken off the scaffolding when we saw this, until it was reviewed. We need to be clear, this is a historic process. Uh, trade unions are outlawed in Qatar and to have this sort of agreement with a trade union global federation is groundbreaking. The benefits uh, of this agreement uh, can only reach one conclusion. We must continue with this agreement and we have to continue with this agreement. It is one uh, that I think uh, that will uh, end up leaving a significant legacy, uh, not just for the Supreme Committee, but I think it will have a bigger impact and a wider impact on Qatar when it comes to worker welfare.